Hey there guys, it's Silver, your host, and we are back for more Pokemon Crystal. Today we are heading through Mount Moon to Cerulean City, and we are going to be dealing with a lot of Zubats apparently. No, we are going to be taking on Misty's Gym next. Then after that, we are going to head over to Celadon, I think. Well, no, we're going to double back to, to Blackthorn, use the move deleter to get rid of Surf from Fang, our Dragonair, and then we are going to head to Celadon and uh, get some more moves for our Pokemon. The encounter rate is crazy high in here. It's alright. We'll manage, I'm sure. Have we got some repels? I, um, I damn well hope so. Yes, we have eight max repels. Good. Good, 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 good. That's it. Oh, no, wait. Mount Moon Square. Just go up the stairs. I have a feeling that I can win. Let's see if I'm right. Hello, Pick-a-Nick-a-Hope. Pick -a -nick -a <coughs> Fluffy, everybody's favorite sheep. Cotton Spore. Well, I'm glad it wasn't a thunder shock or something like that. I um I wasn't well prepared for a potential thunder shock. Okay, done and done. No, oh, you're too strong. <laughs> right. I heard Clefairy appear at Mount Moon, but where could they be? <coughs> More trainers ahead. I'm raising my Pokemon. Want to battle with me? Yeah, sure thing. I'm okay with that. Fine by me, friend. Birdkeeper Hank. A Pidgey. Well, that's shockingly low level. Okay. And now a Pidgeot. That is quite a disparity in terms of levels. Um, you're going to be a problem. Good. At least it can't hit us with wing attack now or fly. Nightmare. Excellent. Side beam. That didn't do a lot. I was expecting more, I really was. Despite us being 10 levels higher, I thought the Pidgeot would hit harder. Level 45. Bird Keeper Hank was defeated. Yeah, I lost that one. Indeed you did, friend, I apologize. Who else is in need of leveling? Um We'll put Bell in front. Yeah, we'll put Bell in front actually. <clears throat> good good. Um I What's up? Cat got your tongue? 
Right. Picnic a Sharon. Ferret. Hey. Ferret has a nice design. Uh, hmm. Sludge Bomb. Almost took it out. Almost took it out. Quick attack. What's next? Rapidash. Yeah. Fang? You are in charge for all things fire related. <clears throat> Even though we will be getting rid of Surf shortly. Forty six Job done. I'll go train some more. She was super quiet and shy. Ooh, HP up. I know who's getting that. Okay. Onwards to Cerulean we go. Yeah. Mark's gonna have that. Okay. Onwards we go. Hmm. So if I remember rightly, as I was saying a moment ago... Sorry, I've totally lost my trail of thought. I'll get it back. Had to run a quick errand for a second, so I'm kind of jumbled. But, we have to go up here to Route 24 in order to get Misty to turn up at her gym. Now then. Hmm. In fact, do you know what I'm going to do before we face Misty? I mentioned going to Celadon. Before, we are actually going to quickly grab Pidgeotto out of the box and fly to Celadon now. Because, if I remember rightly, and I'm sure I do remember rightly, there are some very useful TMs for our Pokemon at Celadon. <coughs> So we're going to head over there. Who's this random guy here? The Magnet Train travels all uh, over 340 miles per hour. It goes between Kanto and Johto in almost no time at all. It really makes Johto accessible. Awesome. Right. Pidgeotto? Let's go. Celadon. Do 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 Perfect. That's in the apartment building. Right. Up we go. To the most tip top floor we can manage. I think it's the fourth floor where you get TMs. Third floor. That's fine by me. Righty. How may I help you? Inflicts damage every turn. Boosts water type moves. For five turns. Boosts fire type moves for five turns. Inflicts damage every turn. What is this? Let me check. Let me check. Hmm. TM 37. 
sandstorm. Oh, we have two of them now. That's a shame we won't use them, but hey. Okay. Wise man gifts. What's up here? Just gifts. No problem. I thought there was a salesman for more powerful TMs there. But I obviously stand corrected, don't I? Anyway, what we will do, because my plan there was kind of foiled, we'll head back to Cerulean City now. I read on Wikipedia, oh sorry, not Wikipedia, Bulbapedia, Bulba Garden, whichever one it was, that you could get psychic TMs in Celadon. And I thought to myself, ooh, Psychic TM in Celadon. Well, if that's the case, we can give one to Jinx and one to our Butterfree. But apparently, not there. So we're just going to have to make do. So we'll head up here. And go and interrupt Misty's date. I'm sure she'll be very happy with us when we do that. Hmm. Right. We'll keep Mark the Meganium up front for this. Beat the six of those trainers to win a fabulous prize. Think you've got what it takes? We're doing the whole Nugget Bridge thing again. Yay! Schoolboy Dudley. A single Oddish at level 35. Hmm. I mean, this won't do anything, but I might as well for a giggle. Yeah. Useless. Swap over to the Queen. Actually. Um, Fang, you can come on out and do this. And Dragon Breath. How bulky is Oddish? How bulky is Oddish? It's alright. And the Oddish is down. Marvelous. Ooh, good stuff. Number two. I'm second, now it's serious. Lass Ellen. Wiggly tough. Hello. Hmm. Has double slap. Might as well reflect. Cool. Ah. Sing. Everybody's favorite move. Um. Hmm. Bell, you come on out. How much will an absorb do? Now, Wigglytuff has a lot of health. A bit, it does a reasonable amount. Just keeps defense scaling. Keep on draining that wiggly tough. <clears throat> One more should do it.
Who's next? Granbull. No, we'll, we'll we'll keep Bell out for this. Sludge bomb. Smack. And poisoned. Yes. Good XP there. How could I lose? Right. Let us use a full heal. We have 12 now. Good. Mark's back up and ready to go. Wide awake. Here's number three. It won't be easy. Schoolboy Joe. All these grass types. Yeah, we're bringing Bell back out. Sludge Bomb's gonna work wonders here. Please give me the one hit. <coughs> Excellent. A Vaporeon. Ooh. Yes. Bell, take the Vaporeon out. One of my favourite evolutions. In fact, I'd say my two favourite evolutions are Vaporeon and Espeon. Yeah, I forgot that Vaporeon is like a health wall. Has a lot of health. Like a lot of health. Three trainers down. Ow. Stomp flat. Indeed. Indeed. Right. We're going to end up facing two in a row here, aren't we? <clears throat> hmm. How much XP does the Queen need? Now we'll let the others catch up with her first. Valentine, if you want in, you can have in for this one. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. I'm number four, getting tired? No, not really. We have a lot more steam left in the engine. A lot more steam left. Last Laura. Right, this is a very good matchup here. Psybeam is why. Straight down. Pidgeotto. Um, no, we'll keep um, we'll keep Valentine in. Every Pidgeotto's favourite move, Sand Attack. Alright. Who is her last Pokemon? Blossom. Hmm. Hmm. We'll use the Queen. 
Yeah, we'll use the queen. Ice punch. I lost two. She sounded so sad there. Number five. We're running a gauntlet here. Camper Lloyd. <clears throat> Nido King. Wasn't expecting that. But that poison typing is fine because Saving. And done. No problems. Whoa, too much. Just two more battles until we're at the end of the bridge. I'm the last in line, but I tell you, I'm tough. Sorry, let me grab a sip of water. My throat's playing havoc again. Right. Last Shannon. What does she have? Hello, Paris. Isn't... Paris is either grass bug or... Um... Bug poison. Yeah. It's grass bug. And I am quite surprised it hung in there against the Psybeam. Another Paris? I'm assuming she'll finish with Parasect. Was that hit a range? No, it wasn't. Oh dear, poison powder. Last up's gonna be Parasect, I'm guessing. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. What to do here? Fang? You can have this. Hmm, what to do? Iron Tail. Smack. That did plenty of damage. Right. Spore inflicted sleep. We have full heals. We'll use one. Do. I have to use a second one on Valentine at the end of the battle. Righty. Sorry, I uh, pressed the B button instead of A there. Good, good. You're kidding. Nope. We win. Right. Last opponent. <laughs> I have nothing to do with the six pack trainers. I waited here to beat you when you were tired out by all the battles. This guy doesn't play fair. Super Nerd Pat. Porygon.
You're gonna get the old sleep powder nightmare treatment. I like Nightmare. It's good. Confused as well. Confused and a Nightmare going on. One more hit should do it. Done. Perfect. Almost at level 46 now, Valentine. Very nice. Aren't you tired at all? I reckon we're good. You took on one more battle than you expected, but you won anyway. As promised, you win a prize. But after seeing how you battle, I want to see how I'll fare. How about it? Let me take you on. Fine by me. Wait there, doesn't this guy have a Charmeleon? Pretty sure he does. Cool trainer Kevin. <clears throat> ah, a Rhyhorn. Okay. Now Rhyhorn doesn't have amazing special defense. So I'm hoping this Psybeam will do good damage. Right. Level 46. Very well done, Valentine. Charmeleon. Yes, he does have a Charmeleon. Um, Fang? Let's surf it out. Hmm. Yep. Let's go surfing. Down in one. Critical hit. Perfect. War total to finish. Mark. Go ahead. You'll be the one taking Misty's gym anyway. Trainer Kevin was defeated. I've never had a battle this good. Well, I'm glad we could please. That was a great battle. You and your Pokemon are truly outstanding. All these phone calls. Hello, Liz. Yes, you have the wrong number. You have the wrong number, Liz. Okay, he doesn't say anything else. Here we go. Hello, Misty. Oh, why do you have to show up and bug us now? You know what they call people like you? Pests. You heard me right, pest. Oh, those badges you have. Are they Johto Gym badges? If you have eight, you must be good. Okay then, come to Cerulean Gym. I'll be happy to take you on. I'm Misty, the gym leader in Cerulean. Right, we've got her. Now, Bill's grandfather's watching the house here. The only way to get elemental stones. You know Bill, he's my grandson. He's in Johto. He does something with PCs, so I'm house-sitting. My grandson, Bill, told me about a Pokemon that has a long tongue. If you have the Pokemon, may I see it, please? Don't have a liquor tongue. You don't have it? That's too bad. Sorry, sir. Okay. Back to Cerulean we head. <coughs> We're going to put Mark in front as well. Mark is going to be in charge. Large and in charge of the proceedings. For our second gym badge. Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, that was the, um... That's the police sign. We read that in a previous part. Okay. Heal up. Yes, please heal our Pokemon. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Excellent. Okay. It's showtime. Cerulean City. A mysterious blue aura surrounds it. Showtime. Cerulean City Pokemon Jib. Yo, champ in the making. Since Misty was away, I went out for some fun too. <laughs> That sounds shifty. That sounds very shifty. Right. Mark is up front. Here we go. We'll take on all these trainers. Good XP. Glub. I'm first. Come and get me. Swimmer Parker wants to battle. Swimmer Parker sent out Horsey. Hello, Horsey. Meet Mark. He is the world's friendliest Meganium. The friendliest Meganium you will ever meet. He's been with us since the beginning. And yes, he doesn't hit super hard. But he is sturdy, dependable, and kind. Seedra's coming next. You keep setting him up. Mark's just going to keep knocking him down for you. And two. Let's make it three. Another horsey. Egg solemn. Done and done. Swim Parker was defeated. This can't be. It is, I'm afraid. Number two. Don't let my elegant swimming unnerve you. Alrighty. Swimmer Brianna. We have the Sea King. Bring on the Razor Leaf. Down in one again. And another Sea King. This gym is like a dream come true for me. We've gone to so many gyms where we've been at a massive disadvantage. And now the stars are aligning for us here. Oh, you calmly disposed of me. Sorry about being away. Let's get on with it. Not a problem. Misty was having a date. Can't interrupt date night. Well, we did. But I typically would not interrupt date night. You know the deal, Mark. Bring on the Razor Leaf. Will Golduck be the first one to survive a hit? Nope. Critical hit. Swimmer Diana was defeated. I give up. You're the winner. I'll be swimming quietly. Alright. Gym leader number two. From Kanto, Misty. I was expecting you, you pest. You may have a lot of Johto gym badges, but you'd better not take me too lightly. My water type Pokemon are tough. Showtime. What you got for us, Misty? The Gold Duck has arrived. 
Level 42. Mark has an advantage here. But I imagine that gold duck is... Yeah, it's bulky enough to survive. Ooh, psychic. Come on, special defense stat. Beautiful. Mark's defensive bulk makes him excellent. In a lot of instances... Right. Golduck down. Lapras is next. Is the Lapras her ace, or is that Starmie? Either way, I don't think anything's going to survive more than two Razor Leafs. This one might survive more than two Razor Leafs. I stand corrected. Oh god, Rain Dance. Um... Yeah, uh, hello, light screen. Ooh, no, 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 no. Hang in there, Mark. Hang in there, Mark. Hang on in there. Good. All right. This may end up being a team effort since that Lapras has blizzard. Okay, Razor Leaf. Wonderful. Almost 48. Starmie's coming next. I'm not gonna gamble here, even though Mark is almost, almost at the next level. Bell? You can have this. Confuse Ray. Alright. Come on. Damn. Try again. Ice Beam. Come on, hit. Yes. Didn't do as much as I would have liked. Light screen has fell. Meaning we're very vulnerable to those super effective hits again. Um, Right. Hyper potion for Mark. Because we're going to have to put the light screen back up again in a minute. Everything we have apart from Queen is weak to Ice Beam here. The least I can do before we go down... Because I have a feeling that Bell, no, the Starmie is going to outspeed and we're going to get knocked out. But I'll go for Sunny Day anyway. Yeah. Makes sense. It's okay. Well done, Bell. You still did good. Mark? Hmm. Light screen? Oh, for goodness sake. I am not being wrecked by a Starmie. Come on, light screen, I need you up. Good. Right, that's fine. Because we will... We will use a full heal to rid ourselves of the annoying confusion. Light screen should... Oh god. Oh god. Oh man. Yeah. All right. Hyper potion. Does almost nothing when the light screen's up. Oh, This is nauseating. This is really nauseating. We've got to take the Starmie out. Oh, for God's sake. 
It's just alternating between Ice Beam and Confuse Ray here. It's really annoying. I'm frozen now. Light screen's down. We got another full restore left, or did we use the only one we had? We are getting walled by this Starmie. Do you know what we'll do? Do you know what we'll do? The Queen can have this. That won't do anything to Queen. How would you like a taste of your own medicine? Oh, for God's sake. For God's sake, this is horrendous. Confuse Ray, Confuse Ray, Confuse Ray, Confuse Ray, stop. I'm gonna lick, because of the paralysis chance. Oh, for... Mm. This is frustrating. It has surf? Well, um... That caught me off guard. Um... Will this be enough to take Queen out? It's gonna be very close. Yeah, Queen's down. It's okay, because we still have three Pokemon left. Valentine. Oh, for God's sake, it has recovery. It has recovery moves. This, oh, this is annoying me more than words can even begin to quantify. Recover, confuse ray, recover, confuse ray, recover, confuse. Silver, happy thoughts, happy thoughts. Do not think of rage and destruction and mayhem. That's going to be doubly effective. Because of Valentine's flying typing, it's gonna... Okay, I expected worse. I did not think we'd end up getting walled by a Starmie for ten minutes. Um... Right. Mark. Like... Fang's not even going to have a chance. The most I can hope is that we completely wear out its Ice Beam PP. That's a poor strategy. But it's the one I'm rolling with, at least. Let me guess, Confuse Ray again, Starmie? Yep. Okay, light screen's up. Razor Leaf. Come on, Razor Leaf. For God's sake. I'm getting so mad here. I'm getting so mad. The fact that it's using Surf means it must have expended all of its Ice Beam PP. Stop with the con- Breathe. Breathe. Yeah, it's out of Ice Beam. It's out of Ice Beam.
good. Raise a life. Ugh. Right, it's finally over. Just about. I did not expect the Starmie would wall us. But it did for the longest time. Quagsire, your four times weakness to grass moves is going to make our life very easy, actually. Okay. Should be over now. It's over. We are done. The battle has ended. We can come home. You really are good. I'll admit that you are skilled. Here you go. It's the Cascade Badge. Or it's Cascade Badge. Are there many strong trainers in Johto? Like you, I mean. I'm going to travel one day, so I can battle some skilled trainers. Alright. Good. So, in the next part, I'm probably going to swing by Blackthorn to take Surf from Dragonair and probably teach it something better. But that'll be in the next part. And then after doing that, we're going to go straight to Surge's gym and take on Lieutenant Surge. But for now, after that epic slugging match, because I'll be honest, I did not expect my entire party to be walled by a starmy. After that awesome slugging match, we will wind things down. So the team are looking very good now. They are looking very solid. We may also see about teaching Psychic to either Valentine or Queen, but we'll see about that later. To all of you who have stopped in and enjoyed our little playthrough session today, thank you very much for swinging by. Do feel free to leave a like and a comment if you have enjoyed yourselves, or maybe even subscribe if you want to become part of our awesome little community. We've been building up quite well over the last year, so always a pleasure to see more people here. Also, if you would like to support us further, you can support us on Patreon for just £2.50 a month or $3. The same price as a small cup of coffee or a bus ticket. And every silver patron gets an exclusive patron shout-out at the end of every live stream and pre-recorded Let's Play part. Not at all essential, but very much appreciated. And the links to that are in the video description and the channel's about section. A special thank you to our first silver patron at the time of recording this video, Mr. Jonathan. It's very much appreciated, and you are super awesome. And to everybody else who's stopped in, thank you very much for stopping in. As I've said, you've all been super awesome. And I will, of course, see you in the next one. So, guys, I have been Silver, your host. Have a fantastic morning, afternoon, or night. And I'll see you again very soon. Take care, guys.